Hello, and thank you for visiting the Obtaining the Massachusetts Transition Specialist Endorsement Component of the Massachusetts Educator Licensure Series, often referred to as MELS. This presentation provides general information intended for individuals interested in obtaining the Massachusetts Transition Specialist Endorsement. Throughout this presentation, there will be references to finding additional information, such as guides, forms, and other websites. You can find links to these resources within the overview located directly beneath this video. In March of 2012, the legislator passed and the governor signed into law Chapter 51 of the Acts of 2012, an act relative to students with disabilities in post-secondary education, employment, and independent living. The law directed the board to establish a specialist teacher endorsement and transition services for special education teachers and rehabilitation counselors. On December 7, 2012, the Board of Elementary and Secondary Education enacted regulations establishing the transition specialist endorsement. A transition specialist provides transition services to students with disabilities with individualized education programs. The endorsement provides recognition of a particular set of skills and knowledge in relation to transitioning to adult life for students with IEPs. An endorsement in this case is an optional form of recognition and it does not require all individuals employed in the role to possess the endorsement for legal employment. However, school districts have authority to establish additional requirements beyond the licensure requirements for their employees and may choose to require candidates to hold the endorsement. Individuals with a minimum of two years of experience under any one of the following initial or professional licenses may qualify for the Transition Specialist Endorsement. These licenses include moderate disabilities, severe disabilities, deaf and hard of hearing, visually impaired, school counselor, or school social worker, school adjustment counselor. Please note that individuals with a minimum of two years of experience under older versions of these licenses, for example, special needs, intensive special needs, or school guidance counselor, may also qualify for the transition specialist endorsement. Applicants who earned a license comparable to any of the aforementioned licenses in another state or jurisdiction and have at least two years of experience under it also may qualify for the Transition Specialist Endorsement. In addition, individuals with a minimum of two years of experience under a Rehabilitation Counselor License issued by the Massachusetts Board of Allied Mental Health and Human Services Professions or a Rehabilitation Counselor Certificate issued by the Commission on Rehabilitation Counselor Certification also may qualify. Beyond the prerequisite license and experience, obtaining the endorsement requires demonstration of the transition specialist subject matter knowledge and skill requirements through the successful completion of a department-approved course of study specific to providing transition services. This course of study includes a 150-hour field-based experience providing transition services for transition-age students with disabilities with IEPs in collaboration with their families, community members, and other relevant professionals. You can find the Transition Specialist Subject Matter Knowledge and Skill Requirements and information about the department-approved course of study specific to providing transition services through the links within the overview located directly beneath this video. Let's cover documenting requirements. As for a prerequisite license, if you currently possess a required initial or professional academic license in Massachusetts, then the Office of Educator Licensure will verify this requirement met. The prerequisite license requirement may also be satisfied through possession of a comparable academic license from another state or jurisdiction. Therefore, if you are attempting to document this requirement through a license earned outside of Massachusetts, please upload a copy of the license for review and consideration. In lieu of uploading a copy of the license, you may upload a letter signed by an authorized signatory written on official letterhead from the issuing authority stating the field, 
grade level, and type of the license held. If you cannot obtain either of them, you may upload a copy of the issuing authority's electronic file, for example a public lookup, verifying the license you hold along with the U official URL for that file. Please also submit a letter on official letterhead signed by a principal, superintendent, or head administrator verifying at least two years of experience under the required academic prerequisite license. If you are satisfying the prerequisite license with a Rehabilitation Counselor credential, please upload a copy of the license issued via the Massachusetts Board of Registration of Allied Mental Health and Human Services Professions or a copy of your certificate as a Rehabilitation Counselor issued via the Commission on Rehabilitation Counselor Certification. Please also submit a letter on official letterhead signed by a head administrator verifying at least two years of experience under one of these credentials. Experience under the license or credential means employment in the role of the license slash credential since the date of issuance. The Office of Educator Licensure will verify the department-approved course of study and the 150-hour field-based experience noted on this slide as met upon receipt and review of an electronic endorsement from a department-approved course provider verifying the completion of a department-approved course of study specific to providing transition services. You can find additional information about the department-approved course of study specific to providing transition services through the link within the overview located directly beneath this video. Please keep the following in mind. The Transition Specialist Endorsement is valid for five years and individuals who hold a valid prerequisite license covered in slide four may renew the endorsement for successive five-year terms through the successful completion of 30 professional development points in the content area related to the subject matter knowledge of the Transition Specialist Endorsement. The 30 PDPs may be included in the total number of PDPs necessary to renew a professional license. Please note that educators that obtain a Transition Specialist Endorsement and are advancing a license to the professional type may be eligible to use coursework completed to earn the endorsement toward the professional license. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about Educator Licensure in Massachusetts. Thank you also for being an educator or aspiring to become one. Your efforts are commendable and greatly appreciated. We hope this component of MELS has been helpful. Please visit other components of the series for additional information about Educator Licensure. If you have any questions or concerns, please do not hesitate to call the Licensure Call Center at 781-338-6600 or stop by and visit us in person at our walk-in service counter at 75 Pleasant Street, Malden, Mass.